this is the only armbar I like highlighted I could ever watch. Actually, I couldn't watch it. I had to turn away. I thought. Oh, really? Yeah. Any, any ever. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Anyway, I'm sorry. I don't like being the player. See, I hope. Okay, Heidi Fang for MMA Fight Corner with Frank Mir. We were just having a conversation here with Ronda Rousey. She said she couldn't watch her armbar. Yeah, actually, it's kind of funny hearing from her. But that's why I just because of Kimura. They don't use him much in judo, they use a straight armbar. So. But uh, that's a huge compliment for so much a, uh, an accomplished submission artist. Now, what are your thoughts on her actually being nominated for four of the awards tonight? Uh, I think that's uh, phenomenal. I like, you know, uh, where the sport's going. Uh, my daughter, uh, you know, is very much part of martial arts and she likes it. And it's funny that now we got, uh, you know, very well respected uh, role models that we can point to in the female community. Now, this year you've spent a lot of it actually injured, haven't got to get uh, many fights in here towards the end of the year. You were supposed to fight Cormier, that was canceled. What are you looking forward to in 2013, and who can we expect to see you up against next? Well, I'm hoping that Cormier has a very good uh, outing against his opponent, which I can't recall his name right now. I don't know. Uh, Dion Starring. Oh, okay. That guy, uh, which the fact that we don't all know his name very well, I'm assuming that means he should do well and hopefully come through unscathed so that he can uh, get what he wants, is which is coming to the UFC, and I can uh, be more than happy to welcome him. Oh, yeah. He actually I said the same on our show about a week ago that he was interested in fighting you still, so he said that he thinks you would be a great test for him. What are your thoughts on that? No, I think it's an excellent test for him. I think that, uh, you know, uh, always be careful what you wish for. Um, you know, I think that his, uh, you know, wrestling, I think, will be tested in our, our uh, fight. Uh, you know, my submissions have the ability to, uh, you know, definitely change outcomes of fights pretty quickly. And what are you presenting tonight here at the award show? Actually, I don't think I'm presenting at all. No, I don't think so. Just hanging out? Yeah, I'm just hanging out. Hopefully, I'll get a couple. Of, I'm nominated for two different awards. I'm sorry about that. What are the two awards that you were nominated for tonight? I, didn't uh, actually get the list. I think a comeback in the, a fight and then also submission of the year. It's a comeback vote for um, Big Nog, yep. Right. Well, we wish you all the best in the nominations, and hopefully we see you up there getting an award. Me too, thanks. Fantastic. Thank you, Frank. Two awards, two wins tonight. How's that feel for you? Uh, it's great. Uh, you know, it's really nice to be able to bring my family and show them that, uh, you know, not only do I get things for myself, but I can do, you know, be recognized for things I can bring home and, you know, and show them that, you know, a lot of the times when I'm not able to be there for them after a game or, you know, go to practice or sometimes their homework, and their mom's having to do it, and I'm laying upstairs half asleep, trying to recover from training, get ready for the next one. That there are things that I can come home with to show them that, uh, that there are uh, rewards to my sacrifices and their sacrifices. Do you think that your fight against Big Nog will go down as the Kimura heard around the world? <laughs> I think it'll be pretty popular for a while. I think that it's the reason why it makes it so historical is actually a, a tribute to him. I know that you no know, one wants to be on that side of a, uh, a highlight reel. Um, but, you know, a lot of times it's what it takes, you know, just putting anybody in a Kimura and having it finished. Had that been somebody else, I don't think it would have had the notoriety that it has uh, garnered. For the reason being that, uh, that it wouldn't have been such top like you know, c competition. The fact that it was against the submission master himself, somebody who's known for submissions and never even been put in close to a, a, a point in his career where it looked like he had to tap, to do that to somebody of that level is I think is what's made the Kimura so great. Well, we wish you all the best of luck coming up in 2013, Frank. Thank, Thank you. So much. You're welcome.